Okay, now we've got to figure out what to do with this box. Okay, we know there's a stud right there in the middle. So there's no way I want to cut right in there, do I? And we know there's some studs over here. Okay, now, is, do I have an option of putting this plug, this timer over here? Because remember I said I wanted it as far to the right as I could. You might say, well, wait a second, Joe. If you put that over there and the studs over here, how on earth are you going to get a wire over this box? Because think about it. We, we got the power coming in right here, wherever I put this box. I put this box here, there, over here, wherever I put this box. I'm going to use this outlet right here as a junction box now. I have to run a, a little piece of wire from here over to the location of, of this box. Does that make sense? I'm going to hook this together with another set of wires, bring them out here. That's going to be my power in to here. Now I'm going to hook that to the timer. Then we got power coming out of the timer back over to this location here for the actual plug. So the plug is not going to be hooked up to any of these wires per se. Okay, the, gra the ground will be, but just, just kind of follow this right now. Okay? So, Wherever I put this, I've got to get power over there. So, so if you say, yeah, there's a stud here. If I put my box over here, how am I going to get my wire over here because this stud's in the way? Are you thinking about that? What can we do about that? Let's talk about this just a little bit further. Let's say that this plug See, remember it's real tight up against the wall. Well, you're not always going to be like this. What happens if your plug, let's say your plug is over here, right where I want the timer, okay? Let's say I get the timer right here. That's where I want to put the timer. Let's say, for instance, the plug is right there. What could I do about that? Well, you know, if the plug was there, because I've got to come into the um, switch, or this, uh, this timer first, I could take the plug out and I could put the uh, cut-in box right here, I could put it over here, wherever. I mean, I could even put it all the way over there if I wanted. Well, take that back. If it was right there, I'm either going to have to put it fairly close to this before the next stud, or if the stud's fairly close, I could drill through that like I was showing you, and I could put that over here, and then I could put the timer here, and I could put the plug over here because I'm going to reroute the wires. Do you see what I'm saying? So um, the thing you want to be concerned about, this is the wide open area over here. This is going to be closer for somebody to turn on the switch. You want that switch over here. And if you got the plug here and the switch over here, now you've got the extension, the cord coming out of the air conditioner plugged in. You've got to reach around that or, or you've got to walk over here. Now if the TV is too close, you can't do that. So. You don't want to be over here having to reach over to get the timer over here. So in this case, because this is the wide open area over here, right here, you want the timer, then the plug. If this was reversed, you'd want it the very opposite. You see what I mean? Think about stuff like that, and you can do pretty much anything. Once you go through this entire process, you'll understand more how easy it is. Hey, if I can do it, I know you can. <laughs>